quick Bitcoin market report from me, your host, Isabela Santos. During the early New York session on the 7th, Bitcoin reached 52,000 for the first time since last weekend's crash to 42,000. However, the price quickly retraced that day's gain as the CME's Bitcoin's futures filled the weekend gap, while the U.S. stock indexes kept the session high and some of the riskier foreign currencies gained against the dollar. It almost seemed like the bears were patiently waiting for that moment to sell Bitcoin. However, Bitcoin found a price support at around 50,000 psychological level and traded mostly sideways during the New York session on the 8th. Bitcoin's weekend crash did not result in a catastrophic start of the week for the world stock market as previously pointed out, as the effect was contained in only some of the crypto related stocks. Rather, the overall risk sentiment has improved as the symptoms from the Omicron variant are turning out to be less severe than the market initially feared. But the U.S. CPI announcement is coming up this Friday, so Bitcoin may struggle to pick a direction until then. 52,000 may continue to be a strong resistance for the coin. In short, buy the dip and stack the sideways action.